In March of 2022, Perseverance drilled a rock with its coring bit and successfully extracted a sample, but it also got a chunk of that sample stuck in the bit, rendering it useless. Two years later, Perseverance has now tried to save the bit. On this episode of Mars Guy, this week Perseverance completed the collection of its latest rock sample, number 24. Here's Mars Guy for scale. This is the same boulder with the weird little spheres that I presented in the previous episode. The coring operation executed without any problems. The big drill combines rotary and percussive action to core into the rock, generating a pile of tailings that scattered across the surface, probably assisted by gusts of wind. Let's hope that the sample actually makes it back to Earth someday. In an unusual twist, this coring operation started with an event that took place two years ago, when Perseverance was still on the floor of Jezero Crater. There it cored into this notably hard igneous rock. That operation pulled out a good sample, but it also produced what the engineers refer to as a mushroom, which is a rock fragment stuck in the teeth of the coring bit. It can happen during the step that shears a rock core at its base inside the hole, which relies on the eccentric features of the tube and coring bit. To shear off and capture the core, the tube is locked into place and the bit is rotated 180 degrees. The coring bit with its mushroom had been sidelined inside the bit carousel until this past week. Apparently the engineers wanted to try to put it back into play. It had already undergone the standard percuss to ingest operation back in 2022, which failed to either ingest or spit out the mushroom. Maybe they hoped it had shriveled some in the intervening years. Here's how it looked in 2022, fresh from the hole, with both fractured pieces of the rock still in place. The bit looks notably free of any rock powder or other dust. Compare that to how it looked after it was pulled from the bit carousel last week. There's clearly been dust accumulating on the bit and the rock, even though it's been stored inside. Note that the outer and inner doors of the bit carousel were designed for a single opening after landing. Presumably, dust accumulation is a more acceptable risk than operational doors. See Sherlock's stuck dust cover challenge in the previous episode. The mushroom obviously has not shriveled, and the percuss to ingest operation that was performed again had no effect. It did nicely shake off the dust though, restoring the golden gleam of the titanium nitride coating. It seems pretty clear now that the stuck rock fragment is not budging, but not to worry, the engineers wisely equip Perseverance with six interchangeable coring bits. That means the bit with the obstinate mushroom can be retired, or maybe dropped in the dirt if the engineers want to show it who's boss.